Hey guys, welcome back to this little update, I guess. Um, Guardian Farm update. I just say I, I found one that actually works pretty good. Um, crap, I can't remember the guy's name. I'll put a link in the description below um, where I found it. But um, I did make some tweaks. Okay, a bunch of tweaks to his, tweaks to his design and whatnot, but. It came out pretty good. It, it functions very good. Um, there was a couple issues with his, but um, we don't have to worry about that. Anyways, the way he did it, um, I followed his design, but like I said, I made some tweaks. Um, cause the way he did it, he had no lighting on there, and there was just crap spawning everywhere. I don't know if that was just... He didn't feel like doing it for his video or whatnot, so I really can't follow him on that, but on his design there... Um, his stuff was using his design things were spawning everywhere i mean i'm not talking about other mods i'm talking about the guardians um they would spawn but they wouldn't just stay in the box and get transported to the nether they would bounce around and it would lower the count because they wouldn't keep spawning so i made some tweaks and you'll see like i guess if you look at his video and whatnot you'll see what i've done differently but i will sometime hopefully by the end this weekend i'll put a tutorial on this and this thing is like very simple to do. You don't need to drain any water. Well, I take that back. You gotta drain a little, this couple layers of water. That's it. You don't have to tear down the temple, monument. Excuse me. You don't have to do anything of that. This is what I like about this. I hate draining. And um, somewhere in this world here, I can't remember exactly where. I have the coordinates written down someplace. I did try the bubble one. It worked better than the other one. But, eh, I wouldn't say it was effective or efficient or anything like that. So, I'm um, just waiting up here, you know, killing some time, let some guardians spawn. Sometimes you'll see them spawn. Sometimes you don't. Like, right over there, you see them. Sometimes they just come out so fast you don't see them. You do get some pigment every now and then. Not sure how, but you do. And, yeah, this thing is very simple to build. And, like I said, the best part is no massive water draining. That's the best part. And what not. All right. I, I have no levels here, as you can see. There's a couple issues I have with it, though, is it's not AFKable per se. You can't just say it and go. You could, but... Not a, you won't be able to do anything. To make this thing AFKable, you kind of need two people. Um, there's no way around it because they go into the nether. You know, after a while, they'll, they'll just spawn and whatnot. And but if you need someone out here in the overworld, then you also need someone AFKing in the nether. Eh, I mean, it's not a bad trade off. But I mean, you can do it yourself. I mean, get yourself a good sword here. You know, with the stuff on it, you get decent junk, junk, yeah, you get decent drops, and well, if you're wondering that, that's technically on the North Pole, yeah, that was cheesy, but that's what, that that's North, and it does matter, um, like I said, I'll do put a tutorial on this, and like I said, and whatnot, and so anyways, let's, I have a feather falling on, I should be able to jump down. Um, without dying. Okay, good. That's this. Um, you'll see this is kind of dangerous. Um, hopefully, I can get into here without dying. Yeah, there we go. Uh, so. I'll fall down this tube here. You should see a bunch of them in here. Let me get down here. See what I mean? That thing works good. You, you just can't.
All right. Finally got them all killed. And look at all this. And like I said, I'm using his looting three swords, so this works. And I'm glad I found one that works. And like I said, I just had to tweak it a bit. I'm going to tweak this a little bit better before I put a tutorial up, so make sure I get so they fall down to one hit. And let's see how long it takes to break this. So I do have a beacon set up with, um, as you can see, um, resistance and regeneration. It's definitely needed. But now you see what I mean. Um, you definitely need somebody else in here if you want AFK. And I got, like I said, to just get the drops. Um, like I said, I'm going to head back over here. Over here, um, we used cobblestone and cobblestone ball here and fences. So we can fit through here. The guardians can't, so they'll fall the other way. Yeah. So, crap. We need to get up there. So let's do a little cheat cheat here for a second. What the heck? Oh wow, I typed the wrong number then. I can't read my own handwriting. Wow, that was stupid of me. All right, so like I said, I'm going to show you when I'm up the lag here. I'm going to AFK here for a little bit here, and I'll just speed things along here. I'll see you back here in a second. Okay, it's been about 10 minutes here. Let's let my help get back up here and we'll en enter again. All right, here we go. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. You don't want to wait too long because now I have no idea where the heck I'm going. It is so laggy, like you would not believe this. Ooh. Yeah, and that's 10 minutes. So if you're going to do this by yourself, I don't suggest doing more in a couple minutes at a time. Wow, I wish I had a FPS on the screen. I don't think I can do that. Am I gonna die? Whew. Still moving without touching any keys. So. All right, finally we're going down.
Yeah, that's crazy. So definitely not do this for the 10 minutes. You know, to the other move. All right, well, let me fast forward this here and get back upstairs and back to the overworld here. I can make it up there. Yeah, I made a mistake to try that out. You know, how long it takes to get a bunch of them. Yeah, that was not good. This is taking forever. Let's see if we get a peek over here from the top down. Nope. Head back up. I don't know, this is maybe what, maybe 0.5 frames per second right about now. <coughs> Excuse me, this, yeah. So this is why you would, it'd be better to have somebody inside the nether while you're over there AFKing. I gotta put a lag kill switch in there somehow. Not somehow, I just need to put it in there. I was just testing this thing out. I didn't do all too much technical stuff except getting it to work. Oh no, I'm dying. Well, I guess this is <laughs> where we'll leave the video then because, yeah, I don't think I'm going to live. All right, so this is where we're going to say goodbye, and you know the drill. You got to be happy, you got to be healthy, and I'll see you next time. Later.